Franklin Yanni on Twitter. Uh, how's it looking inside now? Well, Shannon, I think they put the tarp back on for precautionary measures. But as Mike mentioned earlier, Red Sox Nation has fallen in love with first-year manager Alex Cora, as they should. The skipper has led the Red Sox to a franchise record 108 wins and now here to the World Series. But the world has found more reasons to appreciate Alex Cora's leadership, reasons bigger than baseball. During his introductory press conference as the Red Sox new manager, Alex Cora held a Puerto Rican flag and promised to represent his home well, an island that was hit hard by Hurricane Maria in 2017. And throughout the 2018 baseball season, Alex Cora has given back. The manager asking in his contract negotiations, not for a signing bonus, but for a plane full of supplies, helping 300 families in his hometown. I'm proud of uh, representing not only all the Puerto Ricans that live in the islands, so, uh, but, you know, Puerto Ricans all around the world. As a country, we've done an outstanding job uh, fighting. You know, we're standing up in our own two feet. Uh, that's, that's what... You know, I know there's a lot of people back home that they're proud of me, of what, what I've done throughout the year, but I'm proud of them. His charitable efforts don't stop there. Hanging in Cora's office, a win wall, 115 pictures from each of the club's 108 regular season wins, plus seven more from the postseason. Cora says next year he'll auction off the pictures and donate the funds raised to an organization close to the city of Boston's heart. Next year for, for the Jimmy Fund, we're going to auction it. And, uh, you know, if, I know we're going to make a lot of money for that, and it's for the right reason, and, then, and that's what we're going to do. And Red Sox fans will be happy to hear that Alex Cora has four empty picture frames waiting in his office. He hopes that final picture will commemorate a world championship. Much more coming up from Fenway Park on Eyewitness News at 6. For now, live ahead of Game 1 of the World Series, I'm Ruthie Polinski, Eyewitness News.